Oh, first things first. I'm the realist. Stop it. No, I'm not going to go there. Um, so, real quick, we're only at 76% story completion, and that's a little weird. That's kind of shocking. Especially when we're only within 2% of actual, well, wannabe, so I'm actually, about with that. I do want to check if there's anything updated, which really isn't. An uncollectible, an uncollectible still there. I actually do know what those collectibles are. I ain't telling you until we get that far. Twelve more weapon. Let me take a back show. We'll probably do a show eventually, but right now we gotta help with the farm. Down on the farm. That's where I'll be. We also don't have any weapons, so we gotta be careful of that too. That's strange. There's mail. Oh yeah, it makes sense because uh, how else am I supposed to do it? Let's see what uh. Give me him. Oh no. Milton, get over here. Oh, okay. Mr. Geddes, this is the new ranch hand I told you about. Well, I heard you had some trouble with your welcome, but you kept your nerve and protected my property. No, it was nothing, sir. Mm -hmm. I'm David Geddes. Pleased to meet you. John, Jim, hmm. Milton. Thank you for the opportunity, sir. You and Mr. Dickens. Well, you work hard. You be honest. You'll get your keep. I promise you that. Boy has a family. Well, lucky man. Then you better work extra hard. Good day, Howdy, sir. gentlemen. Sir. You hear that, John, Jim? Extra hard. Hey. Hey! Get over here. Mr. Dickens? Go find old Jim Milton here something to do. Make sure he works extra hard. Sure, Mr. Dickens. He don't like me too much, does he? The world axe is over there. Come on this way. I, I was on my chores anyhow. Sir. Hey. Say, is that your family getting in the wagon up there? Ah, oh, believe it is. Mind if we go welcome them? Not at all. Hey, is it true what they said about you when you arrived? That, that you ran off those hired guns? Look, can we, uh, not discuss this in front of my wife? Oh, uh, no, sure. Yeah, of course, mister. I don't want to worry her. Oh, yeah. I hear that. Mrs. Milton! Jim Milton. How fine you seem. This kind man just collected us. Thank you, sir. I think we can be okay here. It's ranching work. This Get place is kind of... It's fine. But I hear you began your career in ranching by throwing your weight around. Real wise, Jim. What was I supposed to do? The place was getting robbed. So you show everyone who's boss? Real fine. I didn't have much of a choice. I gotta go. Jack, when you're done in here, come on out and lend a hand. <laughs> right. I was going to milk the cows. Come on, I'll do it. You? Are gonna milk the cows? Sure. <laughs> Why not? Oh, uh, I don't know. I, I, I thought you was, uh... I'm a ranch hand. A new one, at that. When you got here, them hired guns? I was just getting my wagon back. That's all. Weren't nothing. Oh, it weren't nothing. It's about time someone stood up to them fellers. No. Well... Where are you from, anyway, partner? Around, you know, up north, mostly. Been in these parts before, but that was years ago. Oh, <laughs> it's changed. The rich fellas are coming in and buying everything, the ranches. But, well, it ain't as wild as it once were, at least. There is that. Say, if it ain't too personal a question, are you a gunslinger, mister? Good lord, no. Nothing like that. Now, just a ranch hand then. Oh. Just a ranch hand. Failed at a bunch of things, like most men. <laughs> well, I feel a whole heap better having a ranch hand like you around. That is for sure. <laughs> Let's see how you feel once you see me work. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. Here's the cows. 
I want to see one. Are you on to me? Yeah, we used to have a bunch of women here did most of the milking. Most of them drifted off. Okay. You fine with milking? You know, I ain't really done much of it. Could never, never really get the hang of it. You serious, mister? Sure. It's Jim. Jim Milton. Hey, just sit down. I'll show you how. Approach her calm now. She don't take too kindly to surprises. Really? That cow likes you. Almost got a pail full. That easy? Lancelot. Well, hey, Lancelot. Hey. We're gonna make a dairy maid of your paw yet. <laughs> I never thought I'd see the day. Watch and learn, partner. We all Lancelot, gotta earn our Bill. keep. Come on. How about you and the boy uh, help me clean out the stables? Sure. Come on, son. Do <laughs> I gotta move like five feet. Twelve, sir. Ain't that grand? It's such a fine name. I like it. I got, I got imaginative parents, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell. Now it ain't pleasant work, but it's got to be done. Mr. Dickens said. I know what he said. We'll do it, won't we, boy? Mm-hmm. Hmm. <laughs> he doesn't know what's gonna happen. Jack's gonna have a bad time. I mean, okay. Lancelot. Well, you get them stalls cleaned out, and I'll see you later. Bye. Okay, Jack. Let's just try and take some pride in this work, hard as it may be. Boy, bring that wheelbarrow over here and keep it close to me. Yes, sir. So he has the easy job. Hold on a moment. You're a long way from Angelo Bronte's mansion now. Sorry, sir. Nothing. Uh. Uh. Coming. He probably doesn't. He probably misses that mansion right about now. <sighs> Stinking piles of. Crap. Yeah. Ew. Good old-fashioned manure. Look out. For some reason you didn't know what maneuver was, now you do. The worst looking maneuver. That was quick. John Marston, the terror of the turds. Yeah. I reckon even your mother would say we're almost done here. You finish things up, I'll go check on her. Okay. <laughs> your fault, you shouldn't mention anything with the knights of the room. I feel like John's stats aren't as high as they should be. I mean, look at his dead eye meter compared to his health and stamina. Hey. Hey. Where's Jack? Shoveling shit in pursuit of the better life you want. Same as I've been. Oh, won't do him no harm. I know. Guess maybe we can last here. Survive. Do a little better than survive for once. I'm tired of fleeing, John. So, well, you know. Me too. Aww. Here's his hat. I'll put some coffee on. Really? 
really? Oh wow! I got a gold. Saw that coming. Woohoo! Thanks for my money. Six a.m. Thirty-two degrees. Pretty freezing outside. Go to TD first, and we'll just keep doing chores. I guess Cause that was pretty short of an admission. Hey, Milton. Can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. <laughs> can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. Right, but... I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. <sighs> but I will work hard, and I learn fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. Okay. That was a lot. Yep. There's plenty more to do. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. Oh god, do I have to manually do this? Now, lift up the other side. They gotta line up, see? Now the next rail. Actually, I have one of these fences right outside my house. Nothing wrong with it. Fine. Okay, no, it's falling apart. But... <laughs> Doing all right. Our fence is from like the 50s, I believe. Oh. Actually, this is a pretty. Good. I love like these random missions, especially in the prologues. There's like this is a random filler to just see how they're going, getting on. That looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but there's more than a day's work here for you. All right. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. Okay, just keep going, John, without me. You don't need my help. Fish your my fence, hold on. Down and get over here, boy. Uh, uh, bison? Hurry. Hurry. Quick as you can. Milton, get over here. Coming. Come on, give us a hand. Know much about bulls, Milton? You know the answer uh, to that. Just the basics. Don't make them mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton? Angus is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Wrecked. Shit. I'll get him. Just keep on him, Mill, and try and calm him down. You all right? Shoot! Shoot! No. Wrecked. Come here, Mr. Mr. Moo. Uh. -uh.
Oh, what the heck? Yes, you did it. The Whoa mad blood did it. Whoa there. Easy. Easy. All better? Okay. <laughs> now come on, you hunk of Chuck. You're lucky you didn't kill anyone. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> Good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. <laughs> what just happened? Like... Okay. Is that literally the entire mission? <laughs> it literally was the entire mission. Wait. Thank you. I'm headed to work today myself, Jack. Huh? So you stay out of trouble. Where are you working? I told you. Cleaning at the doctor's office. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Give the place a tidy. Okay, Pa. I'll see you later. I can't afford a gun right now. Alright, guys, next time on Red Dead Redemption 2, this is such a weird thing. We will visit David Gates. Weird little thing here in this world. Luckily, we're not in trouble anymore, but I'll see you guys in a minute. Alright, the next one.